In 2014, all eyes will be on Scotland as it plays host to two major international sporting events, the Glasgow 2014 Commonwealth Games and Ryder Cup at Glen Eagles. In addition, Scotland marks the second edition of Homecoming. Scotland is expected to reap well over £100 million economic benefit from hosting the Ryder Cup and Commonwealth Games. Today, we talk to some of the key players leading the 2014 activities. James Withers, Chief Executive, Scotland Food and Drink. Well, I don't think we'll see another opportunity like 2014 again in my lifetime. An amazing chance to showcase a nation, really. But from a food and drink perspective, we see this as a chance to really cement Scotland's reputation as a land of food and drink. Scale is no barrier for companies, whether you're a big company, whether you're a small artisan producer, there'll be something for you that year. Gillian Swan, Marketing Manager at Event Scotland, is at the helm of promoting the huge programme of events across 2014. Homecoming Scotland is a great opportunity for food and drink producers to be involved in this exciting year and work with the 2014 food and drink team to showcase the very best that Scotland has to offer. Craig Lear, Head of Catering, Cleaning and Waste for Glasgow 2014. We want to deliver a, a, con a consistent product across the Games. Uh, we also want to focus on healthy eating, but uh, the other aim for us is, uh, is to get people out of their comfort zones. Let's do something a bit different. Let's get excited, Scotland. Richard Lockhead, MSP, Cabinet Secretary for Rural Affairs and the Environment. In 2014, it's going to be a really exciting year. Scotland's going to be at the centre of world attention with some of the biggest events taking place in this country in terms of the Commonwealth Games, the Ryder Cup, and of course it's the next homecoming year as well. And we want the hundreds of thousands of people that are hopefully going to visit our shores to have the best possible experience, and food and drink is going to be at the heart of that. So it's a fantastic platform for the food and drink sector, which is already undergoing a revolution and booming at the moment, to use that opportunity as a fantastic platform for good business and to sell the fact that we are the land of food and drink. 2014 will contribute to the ongoing success of the Scottish food and drink story and everyone really should embrace it. Let's work together to proudly show everyone, whether on home soil or from around the world, that Scotland is truly a land of food and drink. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Be part of it.